How you doing, guys? Hey, how, how are you? Not too bad. Trapper. Jeremy. Jeremy's got a video of what we believe to be the Mothman. It's really a good video. You can see the eyes. You can see the height on it. It was on top of the bridge. And I, I'm really impressed with this video. You live out here, huh? Yes, yeah, sure do, man. Right up over the ridge up there. You hunt, fish? Do yep. All, that? all of the above. It is really nice out here. Thank you. I like it out here. I've been out here for all my life. Oh, is that right? Yeah, yeah. I want to know how in the hell you got that video. How, how'd that come by? I keep my phone in my back pocket all the time. I don't get no service out here, but I take a lot of pictures, a lot of video and whatnot. So I was just coming down off that hill right there. And when I come down off the hill, I seen it right up there on that side right there. I stopped right as I got onto the bridge right there and pulled it out real quick. And he was already moving across. It was kind of dark, so I really couldn't get a very good shot. It just kind of moved out of the camera real quick. Well, I thought that was a fantastic video. All right, I mean, appreciate that. Just, that. Uh, that's great. I mean. Scared the crap out of me. Well, I, I can know, imagine. <laughs> I didn't know what it was. You know, living this close to Point Pleasant, you know, you talk about that Mothman down there on that bridge a long time ago where it fell off. I thought maybe it was something like that. Show us where you're at when you got this video. All right, I'll show you. OK, deal. Growing up in this area, everybody knows about the Mothman. It was down in Point Pleasant. The bridge fell down. A lot of people died. And for me to see it here in my valley scares the crap out of me. So right here's where he's driving? When I come down the hill, I got a little closer to the bridge about right here, and I saw something out of the corner of my eye. I got off of it and was about probably right here. You had a pretty good view from here then, didn't you? Had a really good view. It's in the, you know, it's winter time. There's no leaves or anything on the tree. So I had a really good side of him. Once I pulled the camera out and I seen something go across the camera, that's when the hair stood up on my arms. I wasn't sure what I was getting. Well, I can tell you right now, this is the best evidence that we've uncovered on the Mothman. You know, we had a problem with Buck here. He he kind of got eye contact with what you've seen, and uh, he actually passed out. It was, it was crazy. We was going through a field on a night investigation, and I just felt like something was watching me. I turned around and seen these two big glowing eyes. I stared at it for a second. I hold at the guys, and they turned around. They didn't get to see it, but we didn't make it very much farther. And uh, I started feeling real nauseous and real dizzy. And the next thing I know, I was laying on my back looking up, and Huckleberry and, and uh, Jeff were shaking me and trying to wake me up, and I didn't know what was going on. I blacked out, and I wasn't even drinking Huckleberry's moonshine that night. <laughs> I was out cold. <laughs>